how's it going? David Didier here. Uh, you're probably seeing this video because you're searching for rope halters. So here at the horse trailer, so I just thought I'd make this quick video for you to kind of go through the rope halter that I've been using that I settled on and maybe it might be a good option for you. So when I first started down this journey of horsemanship, didn't really know much about anything, all the different, you know, between web halters and rope halters, which one's better than the other. So I did what you're doing and I went on to YouTube. I searched a bunch of different YouTube videos, realized that from across the board, everyone talks about how rope halters are just a better, a better tool compared to those web halters. So I knew I was gonna go the rope halter route then it was a question of of which one. Everybody has their little nuances of rope halters and what they think is uh, better than the others and take it all with a grain of salt. Mostly, you know, everybody's trying to sell you something so they're gonna say theirs is the best. But the one that I noticed that had a little bit was a little bit different than the others and had some reasoning behind it was Clinton Anderson. So if you uh, follow or search anything about horse training or horsemanship, you're gonna come across Clinton's name when I first started, that meant nothing to me. I didn't know who he was or what he was about. But I did notice that unlike some other rope halters that are out there, his has a two two extra knots here on the nose band. Now most of the other ones all have you know the same size rope, the you know yacht rope, and and the sizing of it and all that kind of stuff. But I noticed that his had these two extra knots here, uh, and he didn't just have it on there just to be different. He actually had them on there for a reason. So your your horse's nose is really can be really sensitive. Uh, a lot of different receptors there and this helps to give on those pressure points right at the top of the nose so obviously these come on the side but these just hit right on the top of the nose which helps them um, be softer kind of from leaning into it helps them with corrections and so I went with this one for the price of it I got it on Amazon I'll put a link below but I want to say it was maybe 40 bucks or so um, but it's one of those where I'm all about buying quality and having something that's going to last and I like the idea and the reasoning behind the features that he had on this one so it comes in a variety of different sizes uh, I ended up going with with black and with this size uh, I think it's just your average your average size um, but that's the one that I went with and then the lead rope I've got it I've been using a 12 foot lead rope it's been great for groundwork uh, and doing that and training and all that kind of stuff um, ended up just getting this this uh, lead rope from Murdoch's. Nothing fancy. I know Clinton sells his own. He can get it in a set uh, and I'm sure it's really nice. I know some of them talk about how the one end is weighted and it helps it helps with desensitizing and other things. Um, I'm sure it's valuable but for me I'm getting into horsemanship on a budget so I'm, I was willing to definitely spend the money on a quality a quality halter and figured I could get by with a, uh, a lead rope from Murdoch so I just went to you know the local farm and ranch store here in, in Missoula and got a 12 foot lead rope and then I got this halter on Amazon and then I ended up taking the clip that came on the lead rope I actually took this clip off uh, it came with a metal clip doing some different work on there. I didn't want to be too uh, Not abrasive, but uh, t just too aggressive with uh, and, and popping them uh, with that metal clip at all So I wanted to take that away the weight of this was enough to get the point across so it's obviously a little less convenient because you can't just unclip it. You can still get this off, but you can't just unclip it. But honestly, it just stays on there permanently. Uh, everything that I need to do, it can stay on and, and it's been fine. So if you're looking for a uh, rope halter and you wanna get a quality one, I highly recommend you check out the rope halter from Clinton Anderson. It's been working for me and I'm sure it'll work for you. See you guys in the next video.